Welcome back everyone to Dragon Quest XI and in the last part we made our way back to Cobblestone which is where we are now and we've discovered that we somehow have travelled back in time and we now have to make our way to meet with Gemma at the centre of Cobblestone. Okay. Have to make our way to some three shaped rock or triangular rock or something like that. I don't know. Huh. Thanks for getting Gemma's headscarf back for her. Right. Come back and play any time you like. <laughs> no. It's ages I got to go home. What should we play now? Well, we could play, um... Oh. Oh. Oh, it was the Yggdrasil route. Are you okay? I lost you for a minute there. Not surprising, I guess. This is Jasper's doing. Came through the city and was well, through the town and the village and destroyed everything. I can't believe they do this. And just because you grew up here? What kind of animals are they? Jasper and his goons must have ridden straight here after you got thrown in the dungeons and torched the place. Yeah. Hey, just now, when you zoned out, the mark on your hand was glowing. And so was the root wrapped around that tree. Was it another one of those visions? He actually used the root to travel in time. Wow. So you... You went back in time and spoke with your granddad and... And yourself? That is seriously weird. Must have been the root here. It must have the power to show you the past. And take you to it. Well, if what your granddad told you was right, then we need to head over to Cobblestone Falls. Where did you say it was? East of the village? Apparently. Listen, I know this can't be easy, but hanging around here isn't going to do anybody any good. Come on. Oh dear. Um. Head to the Emerald Coast and investigate this tree. Okay. Emerald Coast. I think this door was locked at first. Oh yeah, there's a treasure chest. Oh, holy night. Templar's uniforms, okay. Oh, that is one of those little guys again. Jeez. They literally ransacked the place. Have we destroyed these yet? Cobblestone again. Oh, there's a tank here. That's how they destroyed the village. Parlay with your parte. <laughs> right, we are going down to the Emerald. Emerald what? Emerald Coast. Jeez. 
Things are definitely getting worse. So where's everyone at? All the all the people that were that lived in a village, what have they been taken hostage as well? Oh, for, oh, nice. I want to rework something. I can do it even better now. investigate the three-sided rock near cobblestone falls. I think that might be this down here. Something there in the centre, but how do we get there? Oh, here we are. Letters, huh? The top one there's seen better days, that's for sure. My dearest, darling baby boy, when finally you come to read this, I will almost certainly be long dead. You see, not long after you were born, our beloved kingdom of Dundrazil was attacked by an army of monsters. I was forced to flee with you in my arms and expended the last of my strength in ensuring that you escape to safety. If you are fortunate enough to have been found by some kindly soul, you must seek out the King of Heliodor when you come of age. Oh. Our kingdom and his have long enjoyed close relations, and your father and I would trust him with our lives. Uh -huh. Never forget, my son. You are a prince of the kingdom of Dundrazil. But more than that, you are the luminary. Yours is a weighty burden indeed. It is you who must stand against the darkness and banish it from our world. In time, you will come to understand. It breaks my heart to leave you, my darling. But it is the only way. I only hope that one day, you will learn to forgive me. It's from someone important to you, right? Your mother or something? Don't worry, you can tell me about... Oh, there's a gem there. To my dearest grandson. I haven't the foggiest how you managed it, but... I met your future self today. As promised. I've buried some things here that will help you on your way. Oh. Now, have you read your mother's letter yet? It was in your basket with you when I first found you. It was because of that letter that I asked my Amber to send you to see the king when the time came. I only wish I'd known how things would turn out. Uh, so if you knew to put that letter here and put some extra things. Could you not have told Amber not to send him to Heliodor? I don't know why Dundrasil was attacked, or why King Carnelian thinks so badly of you. I'm just an ignorant old man from a little village in the country. But I do know that the answers are out there somewhere. The keystone in this box will open the door of departure off to the east. You must go out into the world and seek the truth. Remember now, don't waste your time bearing grudges and live life with love in your heart. All the best, now and forever. Grandad. Oh. <sighs> Oh. 
So we use the keystone to open the door of departure and head out into the world, huh? Well, sounds easy enough. You better believe I'm coming with you. You said it was just east of here, right? Well, what are we waiting for? Oh, I know what we're waiting for. I've got some unfinished business to attend to. The orb. The King's Barrow's not too far from here. And just down the way, in fact. Let's go claim what's rightfully mine. Okay. Right, so it was his mother's instruction that led to him being sent to Heliodor. So they must have been friendly at some point. Until they were not. Can we oh, we can. Jug of fresh water. Okay. Ah, uh, King's Barrow. that will give me some nice XP. Oof. Oof. Okay, one down. Two down. Another one bites the duck. Right. So Heliodor is to one side. Door of the porch, okay. And there's another camp down there. I'm gonna go to the campfire first. I want to take a look at crafting that armor that I've got. Oh, okay. gonna heal Eric. Because otherwise... Yeah, exactly because of that. Oh. Well, that worked nicely. Huh. Easy. Lamp. It's lamplight. Oh, I wonder what that's for. Yep, yeah. there's a campfire here. Thank you. Uh, let's forge some items. Oh, it's been upgraded. Nice. Uh, I've got armor, isn't it? Armor, scale armor, we've got that already. Templar. I haven't got enough, stop, enough stuff though. Okay. Uh, right. It seems we can't really craft anything anyway. However, so we keep we got anything. Broadsword. What is that? Quite quite the increase actually. Right, I am gonna buy this. Oh, we can 
can get rid of the other one. Oh, can't be so. Oh, mind. There we go. Now we're ready to check on the. What is it called again? The King's Barrow. I will say I don't remember how I retrieved the the red orb. I don't even remember if I did this back when I played it on Switch. It was quite a while ago, so I don't remember much of it, to be honest. Yeah, I definitely don't remember this. It's awfully deserted. Yeah, this looks far too easy to just get there and... Something's happened. What the heck happened here? I don't know. Who did this to them? Probably some monster. Huh? What is that? Yeah, let's have a look around, see if there's anything to break. Any treasure chests? No. Oh! Just hope we're powerful enough to take on whatever's lurking down here. Oh, uh, those, um... Actually, I think I'm remembering this now. I think. I might be complete. Oh, yeah, I do. Yeah, you didn't stand a chance. want some <laughs> nice Ooh, nice yes indeed nice I do believe that I can use boomerangs yeah definitely need all the help we can get metal liquor yeah this is one of the attacks that you'll need to fight metal slimes actually have no idea where we're going. Oh my god, they're all coming for me. Jeez, four of them. Right. It's a shame we haven't got a group attack with uh, our main character. We have this. Another one bites the dust. Oh, nice. Leveled up. New spell. Okay. Says. I think that's the one. Wing of Bat. I think that is a group, um, group attack. Big 
exterior, exterior. I do want to have a look and see what's going on over here. Oh, what are those? Oh, I see. What spell is it? Aha. Jeez. going on here with the exterior. <clears throat> oh, treasure chest. Ooh, strength ring. Yes, please. There's the other exterior bed we can get there on the way out, actually. Oof. These are actually quite hard to... Oh, oh it's a way down again. Okay. Do that just yet. Let me see what's going on here. Oh, there's a treasure chest there. Templar's uniform. He's lost his pet. Still take you out and get the XP, thank you. Popped up quickly. Who else wants? Right, I do want to. Actually. Better. I was going to use the spell, but I need the MP, so I'd rather not. Oh, are they sleeping? 
Still sleeping on a job, I see. Uh, I actually want to check quickly. He's got three points. Can I unlock anything with that? Ten. Six. Flame slash. No chance. Okay. Can't really do anything. Jesus. And another one bites the dust. Uh, I remember this now. You can actually, you can ride monsters. It's a bit of a derogatory term, but it is what you're doing. Magic water, okay. But you need to defeat them first. Okay. Swan some. Who else wants some? Uh, seed of defense, yes. Oh, feathered caps, yeah. Right, uh, items. Yeah, definitely want to do that. Oh, they've got the same. Don't do cam. Because... He's the one with the healing function. Oh, here we go. There's the red orb. Going to get us into his good books. I just Who? know it. We're sure to get a big reward. Hey, what do you think you're doing? That orb belongs to us. Get your filthy hands off it. Okay. <laughs> Whoever you are, you've just made a seriously big mistake. Ooh. And his bugger. His pep ability would come in handy now. Time to heal, Eric. Jesus. He's the only one who can attack two people at the same time, so... <laughs> Running out of MP here. Oh. Eric, it would be nice if you got yourself pepped up too.
Jesus. And guess what we're gonna do to you now? Consider that essentially our first boss battle. Easy. Nice, level nine. New spell. Evac, okay. Oh yeah. No, I don't. Ha! Amateurs. But who the hell were they? And what did they want with the orb? Well, they wanted to steal it, very clearly. Well, whatever. It's back with its rightful owner now. And about time, too. You know, after they threw me in jail, I thought I'd never see this thing again. But here I am holding it. You're some kind of lucky charm, you know that? I've got a feeling that if I stick with you, everything will turn out okay. Uh. Just don't ask me what I mean by everything. That's my business. Oh gosh, what are you what are you planning? Right, I've done what I came to do. Guess we should head east and check out that door of departure place your grandpa mentioned. Right. How are you supposed to know if you're nook and cranny in this place and you don't know what the door of departure is? Okay, any any hidden treasure here? Right, so we've got that spell evac now, which... Uh, no. <laughs> I don't want to talk to you. Yeah, let's do it. I want to do this. This is to get out of a dungeon. Let's think of it like in Pokemon, you've got escape ropes. Although I do want to go back in, because there is that little area that I didn't go to. Oh, didn't realize it would be all this, all this way out, but never mind. Right here. Ah, oh, sh... Shoot. Well, we didn't get attacked once, that's good. Go is right here. I don't actually know if there's anything out there, but the other side had it. Had a treasure chest, so it's worth checking if this one doesn't too. Oh, there isn't one, but there is this. Whatever this is. Hardy hide. <laughs> I don't actually know what a hardy hide is for. Let's get out of this dungeon. Right, we are out of the dungeon and we are going to head off to the door of departure, but before we do that, I'm just going to bring this part to a close and continue in the next one. So for now, stay safe and well everyone, and I'll see you over on the other side. See you next time.